people, they look at me, basically, and they don't really hide it very well. They're always like, I think it's pretty obvious why the kind of outfits I wear is quite similar to um, cosplay. I guess another thing I've noticed is that Korean people, they think I'm Japanese. They always assume that I'm Japanese. Like, for example, when I was on the plane on my way to Korea, those lady people, those people that sell food and stuff, you know? I was sitting by the window, my mom sitting next to me, and then my brother was sitting where the aisle thinking is. When the lady came up to us, she looked at me first, and then she started asking me what I wanted to eat, but in Japanese. I don't speak Japanese, so I don't... I, I replied to her in English. It was funny because she spoke to all three of us in different languages. The second encounter was we were all on the train. I was sitting next to my mom and then suddenly this Caucasian guy, he walked towards us. He pointed at my Pikachu gloves and then he said, Koyangi, kawaii. Immediately, I looked at him like, it's a Pikachu. And then he just giggled and walked away. So yeah, that was weird. And then another time, we were at the Tony Moly, Tony Tony Moly. They saw this cute, it was like a Pokemon edition face wash thingy. I noticed that as soon as I walked into the store, everyone who worked there, they looked at me. Because I was wearing like a, a panda hoodie. They were just giggling to themselves. Yeah. I was looking at them on the stand. As soon as they heard me speak, one of the workers, she was like, Oh, she sounds so cute. I picked out Pikachu and Bulbasaur face washing TV. I walked towards the counter and then when I put it down I was taking my money out. The guy that was working there, he looked at me with like the most it was this, this really angry look. As soon as I saw his face, for some reason I felt like maybe I shouldn't speak. But you can tell when someone really dislikes you. I just pay for this stuff and then I quickly leg it. <laughs> And there was a time when my brother and I, we went to McDonald's. There was this Korean man who sat behind me. While my brother and I were still eating, I could hear someone get up from the seat. Instead, he walked towards our table. He looked at me. And then he said, Oh my god, that's your real voice? And then my brother and I looked at him like, Yeah. He said he thought my voice came from my gloves. That is some kind of high-tech talking Pikachu gloves or something. My brother and I were like, what the fuck? What is happening right now? He went haha, -ha, we went haha, -ha, and we were all happy. So, ha ha ha. Then he complimented saying that my voice was unique. Then there was this other time, we were at the train station, and then I saw these Korean students. There was this girl and a boy, and they were holding hands, so I assume they're a couple. Basically, the boyfriend, he looked at me like this. And the next thing I know, his girlfriend slapped the back of his head and then she started yelling at him in Korean and I, I didn't understand what she was saying. And then after that, she pulled him by his ear and just dragged him off up. And also, we were all inside this really packed train. I was holding onto my brother because everyone was holding onto the pole. I couldn't reach the pole. So I was holding onto my brother so that I don't fall. There was this girl holding onto her boyfriend and she looking at me directly. I saw her like looking up and down at me and she was like this. I get that my style is different. So yeah, there's that one. And then also, I'd say that Nande Moon Market is the most interaction I get. Mostly I get old ladies or old men who come up to me and say that I look cute and stuff, but they say it in Japanese. They always say I look kawaii. They start trying to make conversations with me in Japanese. My friend would always pull me away from them and be like, let's go, na 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 na, let's go, let's go. This middle-aged man looked at my Pikachu gloves and then he suddenly went, Pikachu! I actually got that recorded. It's in one of my career vlogs. That was very random, but it was quite funny. It doesn't really bother me that they think I'm Japanese or whatever. I'm just gonna end it here. Thank you for listening. I don't really have much else to say. Bye-bye.